from the home of the Spirit Quartz Bukenite Hook, South Africa. Very typical formation. Central quartz crystal, as you see here, surrounded by smaller quartz crystals. This guy on its own would stand like this. So I would have it on a little stand going around like this. Can be viewed all the way around. Now the fascination about this piece. First of all, we have the typical form. And there you can see what happens. You'd have the core quartz crystal surrounded by a blanket of newer ones. Then when we look into the faces, we see the color. And the, the amethyst is concentrated uh, generally, usually from this deposit around the inside edges. In this case, there seems to be a shot running in. Now, on this particular kind, I'd expect to find little cubes of pyrite trapped inside the quartz crystals. I don't know if we can see any here. If you see a little black spot or a little fleck inside there, those would be tiny pyrite cubes included. If they are there, I'll mention it in my description. Very, very difficult for me still to photograph the, the spirit quartzes. Um, reason for my selection here is, is, is to me is quite obvious. It's a lovely form. Color-wise, amethyst mixed with almost a redness, which would be an inclusion of hematite uh, uh, in the quartz or hematite going into girthite. So what we have here is a, a ferruginous amethyst from the home of the spirit quartz. Book and I took South Africa. And let's see if we can find a starburst in this guy. I look at that from the top down. Quite, quite magnificent.